Lovely Istanbul. It's another chapter here, another day, and I think on the docket today, we're gonna go find a scammer. Yeah, it's about that time, isn't it? I've done a lot of scam videos in Istanbul, and it's just, I guess, time for another one. Even though I'm running out of ideas and stuff, I might have to duplicate different scams, whatever, because you get different reactions out of people. They get angrier, or, you know, it's funnier for me, all these different things. So today on the docket, the scam is the shoe shine scam. So they have these guys with the little mobile shoe shine kits. And what they do is have this little kit with the brush out and they'll walk around and they're gonna drop the brush as you're walking by them. They'll drop the brush strategically. They drop the brush and you go to pick it up. Oh, you run up. Excuse me, sir, you dropped your brush. Oh, thank you. Let me give you a free shoe shine. As we know, nothing in this life is free. There is no such thing as a free shoe shine unless you do it yourself, that is. Well, I've noticed here on Galata Bridge, there's a shit ton of these guys, the hustlers for the shoe shine scam. So we're just gonna walk around the bridge here. They're probably everywhere though, so you gotta be careful in any tourist area. The, now the stationary shoe shine guys, those are okay. If it's like this big thing set up and they clearly can't walk around with it, you're good, you know they're fine. But the issue with the mobile shoeshine guys is they can scam you and then they can just take off. So I noticed a lot of them are mostly here on Galata Bridge. As I said, we're going to walk Galata Bridge here and see if we can find any of these bad boys out here today. Shine? Huh? I'll wait for you to drop the brush. Yes. Did they drop the brush? Yes, yes. Did you drop the brush, sir? Shoes. Shoes. How much? One lira. One lira? Good price. Good price. I heard that sometimes they have the brush walking Not with brush. the shoes, only shoes. Oh, no brush. Okay. Okay, bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you. So we can see how that one goes, guys. They have. Uh... So they walk with the brush, as you can see, and they had a couple victims there. They see the cameras right away, though. Uh, and get a look at this beautiful view here, guys. Isn't this nice? Nice day on the Bosphorus here. Yeah, no, it's beautiful here. Look at all the nice birds. It's beautiful. And they are offering shoe shine, one lira. It's a good price, guys. Good price. You're not dropping brushes, though, right? Because I read, I read on the internet. I read on the internet that uh, I read on the internet that this is like a scam. You guys dropped a brush. I am not my walking my only and sleep. only sleep, but no walking. Not trick. You, you, YouTuber, you only pawn. But do you walk with the brush and then drop the brush on the ground? How much you charge tourists? How much you charge tourists when they you drop the brush? No, that's okay. Police? Where is police? There they go. Okay, so we got a couple shoe shiner guys baited in there. 
but they are smart, they understand. They saw me filming right away. You can't trick these guys. They see the cameras, again, back to me needing a proper hidden camera, or if it was colder out, I could have my uh, jacket on and stuff. But unfortunately, right now, it's too hot out. Unfortunately, it's too hot out, and I've got no way to really hide the camera. But yeah, they had Hawkeyes. They were right on it immediately. And of course, he's going to tell me it's one lira for a shine. So I would love to know if anyone's been scammed by this before. How much do they charge you? Probably, you know, 40 lira or something to a tourist. Because see, those guys we saw, they had picked up the brush and they were getting their shoe shine, but then they were like, hey, what the hell are you doing, you know? They didn't pay anything, so just be aware here on the Galata Bridge for these guys with the shoe shine scam. If anyone drops a brush while you're walking around, don't pick it up. Just, just keep going or throw it in the Bosphorus if you want. That could be exciting. But the thing is, just be wise out there, kids. This is what I'm here for. I'm kind of a jerk about it, but that's fun for me. I enjoy that kind of stuff. A lot of people would just walk away, but I walk right towards them because I am the one who knocks, you know that. And I've also learned though, look, you can cross the Galata Bridge here. I was an idiot for the longest time. Well, I kind of still am. And I didn't realize before that you can go under the bridge halfway in the middle here. Oh, I got a fresh uh, hairdo. That's what they like to do here is people come to Turkey to get nose jobs and hair, uh, hair plugs, I guess is what it's called. Hair club for men. Uh, yeah, no, it's around this way. See, even I don't know where the hell I'm going. Look at this beautiful view. Yeah, no, it is definitely not this way. Rookie. Am I like a stupid tourist here or something? So there's definitely a way to cut through here, though, by the Balak Ekmek restaurants, where you can get Merhaba, where you can get all the Balak Ekmek you like. Now, those guys ran across the street. Let's go see if we can find them on the other side of the street, because that's also fun for me. Yeah, see, you come out and you're on this side. And we can go up the stairs over here. Watch how surprised they are to see me over here. Guess who's back? My friends. Hello, sir. Why? How are you? You crazy? <laughs> you crazy? Crazy for? You crazy? <laughs> yeah. I just like you to. You crazy? I like to see the games. My friend, Polisai. Polisai Rasana. There we go. Yeah, be careful. You could you could just search YouTube also. You'll find me. You are not happy. Do you enjoy scamming tourists though? My friend, do you enjoy scamming the tourists? You do, eh? Not tourists. You you crazy you. Oh, but but with the shoe shine thing, the the I game? Am not shoe shine. I saw the shoe shine. You like the game, eh? I do. Watch out for the scammer, 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 scammer. All right, and 
we're gone. That's... We don't need the police on us again, so we're gonna go. So we will hide over here. And we will spy around the corner for him. All right, guys, let's flee the scene. Here we go. Let's go. And away we go. Because I'm not sure if it's legal or not. But he definitely called the police. So we got to get the hell out of here. Whew. for the YouTuber kids. Sometimes you gotta run for it. Okay, I think we outran him. I think we escaped. Because oh, I didn't want to risk if he was calling the police and if I am in the wrong, even if it's a scam. Um, maybe I'm not supposed to record him. I don't want to make it up to the police to decide if it's legal or not. So, whew. We ran like a scared little girl to get the hell out of there. Oh, I think we're okay now, though. I think we're okay. Let's see what happens. Well. <laughs> How's that for some action, kids? You enjoyed that one, eh? Well, I'm pretty satisfied with that. Mission accomplished. Scammers, zero. Stupid tourist, one million. Till the next one, kids. Why, why don't you just give me a few euros? I have found this for you. Sounds fair. This is finder's fee. I get it.